Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Nick Gray, the High Tech Traveler, and today I am doing a speed test comparing these two devices, the brand new HTC U12 Plus and the Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus, which is one of the most popular devices of 2018. Now these two smartphones have a lot in common. They're both running a Qualcomm Snapdragon 845 processor on the inside and six gigabytes of RAM. And while Samsung's phone is a little bit larger with a 6.2 inch display as opposed to the HTC U12 Plus's 6.0 display, both of them have roughly the same resolution of a Quad HD Plus panel. So the question is, with all of these specs being pretty much the same, which of these two devices is actually quicker? And that's what we're gonna find out today. Now, as I do with all of my speed tests, I start things off with a fresh boot. This ensures that all applications are cleared out of memory so that the speed test is as fair as possible. But it's also fun to see which device has the quickest boot up sequence. Now, in all of the speed tests that I've done, I haven't yet found a correlation between boot up time and the actual results of the speed test. So just keep that in mind. In this speed test, I'm gonna be opening up applications simultaneously on both devices to see which device opens the app quicker. And once I run through all of the applications, I'll be coming back for a second round to test out RAM management to see which device opens the app quicker from memory. So with that out of the way, let's get started. After round one, the HTC U12 Plus has the clear lead with a score of eight to four. But the Galaxy S9 Plus could make up some ground in round two. So let's see how things go.
So the Galaxy S9 Plus did make up some ground right at the end with a few extra ties, giving it a final score of 16 to 10 in HTC's favor. Now this may sound like there's a huge discrepancy in performance between these two devices, but if you look back at the video, you'd see that the Galaxy S9 Plus was only a fraction behind the HTC U12 Plus most of the time. And this you probably wouldn't even notice unless you were holding the devices side by side. So when it comes to day-to-day -to -day performance, the HTC U12 Plus and the Galaxy S9 Plus are practically on the same playing field. But if you're thinking about buying either of these two devices, you should probably go with the HTC U12 Plus if you simply want the fastest of the two. If you agree, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, I hope you give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I've got more speed tests with the new HTC U12 Plus coming up within the next couple days. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.